You know when you catch a girl looking at you and you think, was she checking me out? Or was she just looking around? Or maybe there's something on my face. Then you wait around trying to figure it out until it's too late, she's gone. You're never gonna see her again. She could have been the love of your life. Well, I wanna make sure that doesn't happen to you ever again. Let's go over the six obvious signs that a girl wants you to approach her. And before we start, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Alex Costa because as you know, we're dropping the BP and Alex Costa collection on August 22nd, including what you're seeing right here. And yes, everything will be super affordable. I know you guys are asking that, so don't worry. I made everything in this collection for you guys, thinking about what you would want. So I'm pumped to launch this thing already. All right, let's get into it, guys. Sign number one that she wants you to talk to her. When they talk to themselves in front of you, and what does that mean exactly? I'll give you an example. She is standing right next to you by herself. And she says something like, oh wow, it's so cold here. Or oh my God, I'm so tired. It feels like they're talking to themselves, right? But wake up, man. In reality, they're most likely just trying to get your attention. It's not like a girl is just gonna approach you, introduce herself. That's not how it works. We know that. So that's her way of getting your attention and opening herself up to a chat. Don't lose this opportunity to talk to her, all right? If a girl does that, just respond politely, come up with a funny comment back, ask her some questions to spark up that conversation. I'm telling you guys, this is a huge sign and it works. Don't think that she's just saying that to herself because most likely she said that out loud so that you could hear and chime in. Sign number two, the typical, the classic move seen in every romantic movie in Hollywood, playing with her hair. There are a lot of shy guys out there. A lot of us can be shy or scared. It's normal. It's hard to find that inner courage to approach someone, right? But keep this in mind. Girls can be shy as well. They get nervous too, of course, especially around guys that they want to talk to. And that leads them to fidget. It leads them to play with their hair. Us guys, we might, you know, fix ourselves and put our hands in our pockets, do a little quick hair fix like this, change our posture, right? Put our chest out like that. But girls usually play with their hair. That's their go-to move. If every time you look at her, she's gonna fix her hair, check her makeup, it could very well mean that she wants to look good because she knows that you're looking. So use that to your advantage. Approach her nicely, introduce yourself, find out whether or not she wanted to talk to you. Next up, this is another classic one. She keeps moving closer and closer to you. If a girl keeps inching closer and closer to you, making eye contact, then she probably wants you to talk to her. Don't confuse this with a girl getting pushed into you at a club. That is definitely not what I mean. This is for when a girl is purposely moving closer to you and you can see that she's doing that to give you a chance to talk to her. And this is what I'll say about this one. You're probably gonna know if she's doing it on purpose, right? If she's moving closer and closer and the only thing that's keeping you guys from talking is your anxiety or you being shy, then please put that aside, man, and just open your mouth. Just open your mouth and say anything, anything at all to get the conversation started. You can literally say, hi, my name is, and go from there. It doesn't even matter because if she wants to talk to you, she's gonna go along, she's gonna play along. And if she doesn't, she's just gonna move away or say no. Pro tip here, guys, remember that everyone gets rejected, all right? Even the hottest celebrities, I've seen it, first hand. Don't let it bother you, just brush it off. Maybe she has a boyfriend, she's not in the mood, she's leaving, she just had a fight with her friend. It doesn't matter, let it go. Number four, pay close attention to her body language. We communicate so much through our body language, right? You can look at two people talking 30 feet away from you and you know if they're having a good time, if they're fighting, if they're happy, if they're tired, it's easy to spot. So a lot of times girls are gonna know if you're into them or not before a single word comes out of your mouth. Listen, reality is us guys, we're just not as good when it comes to reading body language. Girls are good at that. It's a little scary. But we do have a few tricks that we can use, like if they're leaning towards you, that usually is an indicator that she wants to be closer, wants to interact with you. If you're talking to them and they're kind of like angled away from you, giving you the cheek like this, it usually means they don't really want to talk to you. They're not even facing you. Like you're getting the cheek, you know what I mean? But if they're facing you, if her toes are pointed towards you, then that's better. This is a really good tip for smaller places like bars, coffee shops, house parties, because you can actually really read the body language a lot better in those places than let's say in a club, for example, where it doesn't really matter if she's looking at you or not. She might be squeezed and like not facing you. It's not her fault. Number five is the most obvious sign she can ever give you, and that's eye contact. I think if I were to ask most men why they approached a woman, right? The answer would probably be something like, 
she kept looking at me or we kept locking eyes with each other. That happens a lot. It really does. And you don't want to miss that opportunity. You, want to, you don't want to miss that sign. There are always excuses not to approach a girl, even when they give us like obvious, obvious signs, like the long eye stares. Like, you know she's staring at you. There is literally no one behind you. There's no one around you. She's looking straight into your eyes and burning your soul. And still, you know, some of us are gonna go, nah, you know, she's, she's probably just thinking and just gazing out into nowhere and I happen to be nowhere. Are you kidding me? Don't do that. You know, we tend to make excuses when we are too shy. We tend to make excuses when we're not confident enough. And man, we miss so many opportunities because of that. If you keep looking at each other multiple times and if she throws a smirk here and there, then man, like, you know, you gotta say something. Just go up, introduce yourself, see what happens. There is no harm in saying hi. And I'll tell you what, I guarantee you're gonna know right away if she's interested in you or not just by how she handles that approach. The next obvious sign is when she is not only looking at you, but also smiling. There's nothing like that feeling of noticing that a girl is looking at you. You're not sure if she's into you or not, right? And then she looks at you again and she just, she smiles. She's having fun, she's being flirty, she's in a good mood. It's good vibes all around. It makes it easier for you. So now you can approach her, you can say hi, you can even be funny and try like a cheesy pickup line if that's what you're into. It's probably gonna make her laugh. You can say something like, do I look like a camera? Because I'm pretty sure you keep smiling at me. Or you can say something like, all right, let me get in the zone. <clears throat> Uh, I came over here because I noticed your smile and you're definitely one of those people who floss twice a day, don't you? And I know you guys are laughing at me right now and yeah, it's stupid, you know, but it's a great way to break that ice. She's gonna know you're being dumb. She's gonna laugh at you and you know, you take it from there. Guys, this is such an exciting month for us, you know? I just announced my clothing line with Nordstrom. It's dropping on August 22nd. We have flannels, we have tees, we have jeans, leather, suede, and denim jackets. We have sneakers, we have boots, sunglasses, we have it all. And I'm so pumped to see you guys rocking my collection in just a few days. So thank you guys so much for the support over the past few months. It's been an, an amazing journey. This summer has been <laughs> incredible. I'm super excited. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you learned something new. Uh, those cheesy pickup lines, give them a try, I swear to God. I know they're funny and they're stupid, but it works. All right, thank you so much for your support. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Peace.